Green light is on. Hi. <laughs> what Hi. What does the green light Hi. mean? It means we're going. We're, we're going. Live. Where are we going, Danny? <laughs> we're going to the land. We're going to the safari. We're going to the land awesome. of the live. The live. live. Safari. The Welcome to Guys Talk Knives Live lost. here at Smoky Mountain Knife Works, SMKW.com. Marshall, Will, and Holly. Marshall, Will, and Holly. Yeah. Land of the Lost. Oh. Marshall Will and Holly. <laughs> Marshall Will and Holly sounds like a great name. Marshall Will and hey, Holly. Hey, there's old Marshall. Marshall Will and Holly. That was Will Ferrell's name on Jay and Silent Bob Strike Back. Was Will, it? Marshall Will uh -huh. and Holly? Will because Ferrell. of Land of the Lost. Oh, wow. I get it now. Yeah. Will Ferrell's fantastic. You know he, he still has a like the very first like Blackberry phone with a bunch of rubber bands and stuff on it to keep the keyboard on it. Really? Apparently, doesn't surprise me. Uh, so Kevin Hart said that he was like the biggest cheapskate there is. Like he has all this money. <laughs> But he doesn't get new clothes. He doesn't get new shoes. Like he still wears the same like wow. same I shoes, see that. same BlackBerry phone. Like apparently he's a, he's an oddball. And I'm cool like, though. really? You don't say? Yeah. Have you not watched any of his movies? Some of that's got to be real. <laughs> not, Some has got to be his personality. That's, that's funny. Everything from Padre Di Mikasa. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to the show. We're gonna talk about all these knives on the table, like we always do. I don't know. I'm in that voice. What about today. this one. Uh, we are going to talk about that one. How about that one? Mm, yes, we're going to talk about, about that, that one. one. This one? Yes, okay. we're all going to talk about that one. What about the one in your hand? Um, yes, we are talking about that <laughs> cool one stuff, as well. Cool yes. Stuff. Uh, so yes, all of these knives, we are going to talk about them. We have very little business to get through today before we get the we show do. started, uh, but we do have business. Well, hit the business, sir. I'm going to hit the business. Get the business Business out being here. hit right now. Last week we gave away an artisan shark made of brass. Yes, yes. we did. A brass shark. Brass shark. And that went to Mr. Christopher Williams. Christopher yeah. Williams, you won the artisan brass shark. And then we had high hopes to get a belt razor sharpened all the way up. The Rough Rider New Orleans the belt razor. have not been dashed. That, no, but they have been delayed. Sure. Uh, we were going to put into play dutch on it, and our laser engraver needs some toner. Yes. So yes, we're, it we're in a little holding pattern. Yes. But Mike, was that Sebula? What do you think that is? Sebula? Yes. C-E-B-U-L-A. Sebula. Sebulba. Sebula. 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 Chabula. Chabula. Sebulba. Sebulba? No, there's no extra alien from the Phantom Menace. Sebulba. Alubek. That's backwards. He won the Rough Rider New Orleans Belt Razor. Best video this week. I think the guy's name was Keith Carson? or I think it's Carson. He shaved with the New Orleans belt razor for Dude, real. I'm telling you, I it. it was it awesome. amazing. It was awesome. I just I watched in pain the whole time. I haven't purchased mine yet. It may actually happen today. It was a crazy. Are you town. gonna? Is that gonna be what you shave your beard off with? No, 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 no. no. It's not. <laughs> well, I have such sensitive yes. skin anyway. It'd be a problem for me. I, you know, I would. I, I always claim that I do, but I shave so infrequently at this point in my life <laughs> that I don't know. It may just be because I'm not used to shaving. Jason's just going to let the hair connect from his front to his back. It's getting there. It's getting there. <laughs> it started it, driving you're going to have to call, start calling you Jared. I know, right? His pelt looks nice this time of year, though. Well, the nice thing is he doesn't have to wear. He just wears sleeves, and it's like a sweater vest. <laughs> Goes to the lake in the summer. Everybody's wondering why he's wearing a poncho. Like, yeah. No, that's his pelt. He gets out and shakes like a dog. He does. He does. It's <laughs> when he cleans himself noise. on the boat. That's the bad part. Well, you gotta have a pastime. You gotta have a pastime. <laughs> I'm glad you're joining us here on Guys Talk Knives Live. We're a little slap happy because we've yes, been we in are. big time planning mode. And next week is Halloween. Yes. Mm. We're dressing up. Yes, we if are. If you watch any live during the year, not next week. Don't do it. It's gonna be scary. <laughs> no, no, watch that one yeah, and then watch all the, the ones one to, to watch. follow. Yeah, we're, we're going to be, be in, fun. We're going to be in costume. Yeah, Andy's got a really scary costume. I do have a scary costume. Probably going to have to have some therapy after I do this. Probably. <laughs> uh, definitely going to have to see a therapist. <laughs> Check, build some time. PTSD. I'm going to build somebody afterwards. You are. <laughs> <laughs> and it has nothing to do with this costume. Just <laughs> He's just in a pillaging mood. It's a Halloween tradition. <laughs> nice. Somebody gets pillaged. Oh. <laughs> 
It takes a pillage to raise a child. <laughs> we sang that song in chorus. It's a village, not a pillage. I know. Yeah. Okay. We sang the song in chorus, yes. I'm telling you. That it takes a pillage to raise a it child? It takes a whole village to raise one child, something like that. Can you to raise our children. Something like that, yeah. Can you sing it for us? No. <laughs> no. <laughs> if you don't know how this show works, we have seven <laughs> knives on the table. We're going to go through them. They are categorized. We will hit all the highlights of these. Uh, we will talk about them individually, show them to you. We and got some cool stuff on the table. We do have some cool stuff on the table this week. Like almost more um, so than usual. Yes. We she got some fun cool with these yesterday. The yeah. <laughs> she did. She she had fun with them. Yawny, yawner. Uh, we're gonna work on our case knife skills. I don't know what is wrong with me? I am the biggest yawner in the world, and it's so rude. I try so hard it to just happens. eat it and make You're it go fine. away, but then it's You're like, fine. oh, we're coming back again. There's this little thing called sleep that if you do it. It will help you not be tired. Um, it's really not even because I'm tired. I yawn throughout the entire day. Like the, if I could count how many yawns I yawn in a day. So what you're saying like, what is, is you wrong? get very little oxygen to your brain. Apparently. <laughs> I need <mean> more. <gasps> <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's jump into these That's and uh, head through. Starting with the something new, which I'm in love with this knife. Uh, I don't care who every you time are. I, pick it I up. don't care how much it costs. Yes. It is fan freaking tastic. Oh, I think you'll like how much it costs. Oh, then. I think you will too. Marbles. <laughs> Just take in the coolness of, of that cleaver. Marbles that cleaver. Even. Let's put it down here. Jason hits the Wow. All right. So. Oh, almost lost it because it was heavy. <laughs> Marbles cleaver. 3.25 inch. 440A cleaver blade with a blood groove. Stone wash finish. 3 16th inch Look thick. Look at that. It is a horse of a little <laughs> knife. It's a horse. A horse. Horse. Full tank construction, yeah. raindrop sculpted G10 Whoa. handle. Yes, not making that up. Raindrop sculpted G10. It looks like pedals are on it. it. Does. Red liners, yes. double screw rivets, nylon belt sheath with a paracord lanyard, which I really dig the sheath as well. Yes. Seven and a quarter inches overall. Ding. Weighs seven and a little bit more Ding. than seven and a half ounces. Ding. She's and already yawning again. Shut up. <laughs> it is 15 <laughs> bucks. 15 bucks. Fourteen ninety nine. You should all be ordering one of these uh, right now. I have already had. We, this is the swags report today. Give me a yes. Thumb. And uh, here, just cut it right off. <laughs> no, no, it's swags report today. I've already had people saying, "Oh, I'm buying that." Yeah, it's happening. It's so fantastic. if you need one, what do you want? Paper. You're gonna have the same difficulty. It, you you have. are. It's a big thick. It's thick. See? You're gonna be Maybe don't pull the blade out of the paper before you threw it off. <laughs> Seriously. Uh, yeah, seriously. Why do you do this? <laughs> Give me this. So if you need something to assist with the mini axe and Dude, the cheese log. You've been doing this for forever. Yeah. Uh -huh. What about that? <laughs> <laughs> Again, it's because it's like really full of nip hop rapper. <laughs> Oh, she Ed Lover. Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> 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 I spit all over oh, myself. What you gotta do? I I dig <laughs> that. I think that we need to manufacture a sheath that holds this and the New Orleans belt razor in the same little pouch. Yes. Chop Why not? Thumb, shave and you can pull them both out at the same time. I'm over scared. This rivals the Marbles Mini X for the cheese log. I'm just it saying. Does. This is like your summer sausage helper. This is. <laughs> Hold on. This is... I gotta get a different one for the summer sausage. God, it does need a ring, doesn't it? It does. That'd be cool as mess. Be able to spin that thing. Cool lose a finger while you're doing it. I love that noise so much. It's I so know. funny. I don't I, know why. Yes. I love it. It's got a stonewash finish in the flat. It's just great. And then a brush set and finish in the. And it's such that, a that groovy right looking there. knife. Mm, 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 mm. Stonewashed, brushed. And sometimes Puddles. you see one of those and you think, Best. well, you know, I could take the handle off of that and do something different that's really, really unique. Like, why? No, that handle is unique and groovy as hell. Yeah, you could. Groovy. You could paracord wrap this thing. Yes, you. What? Why? You no. Mm -hmm. No, do not paracord wrap that. And for you folks out there who jumped on us because we called it a blood groove in the Swags Report, yes, we know it's a fuller, but we prefer blood groove for the chop. Are you serious? Yes. They're mad about blood groove? They weren't mad. They said the correct term. They get salty is with fuller. me about a lot of things I say. They do. Is blood but here's groove. the thing, guys. It's a fuller, actually. I'm learning new words. But all it's time. very commonly referred to as a blood groove. You're because a blood that's groove. more neat. <laughs> 
turd. <laughs> you said it like Ish. Danny McBride. Because that's more neat. neat. <laughs> er, I've been drinking green tea all morning, old watching man. Watching way too much Righteous Gemstones. <laughs> nah, it's a funny show. It's a fan. Fourteen ninety nine. I love it. It is. I love it. A beefy little dude. Blood groove and all. John. Beefy little dude. That's like a yeah. police knock. <laughs> police. I think, I think that should be uh, an everyday uh, part of the tactical carry for, for the SWAT team. On a lot of these little tiny flavors. A lot of these house brands that we have, we have the Easy Snap. Yes. So it, it is, well, the knife has to be in it. Yeah, it but does. Yeah, it does. It pop off. Yeah. Real easy. Very, very neat. Real easy. Things you ain't going to break your thumbnail with that. Things just pop off around here. That's right. And that usually right? usually I will gripe about a nylon sheath. No, I'm no. not about that one. That's perfect. No, it's good. Yeah. I like nylon sheaths. It's good. You know me. I want it to be Kydex or I'm going to whine and complain yeah, you're like a child. Complain, yeah, you're little child. <laughs> I really am, but I like that one. Bargain of the week. Yeah. You sounded like a baby. Buck. I sounded like a dying calf in a hailstorm. <laughs> you know what? Really, these first three could all be bargains of the week. Bargain of the week. This is the Buck Vantage Select Liner Lock. Select. Vantage Select. Select. I love it. <laughs> liner so, Lock. 3.25 inch 420 HC drop point blade satin finish. Manual flipper or thumb hole opener, liner lock, OD green injection molded GFN handle, tip up pocket clip, 4.375 inches close, 7.6 inches overall, 3.7 ounces, made in the USA by Buck. 428C with the Buck Heat Treat, which we all know and love. And Swags and I discovered something yesterday when we did these. What about this thing? Did we learn? It's ambidextrous. It is ambidextrous. It's oh, it sure is. Yeah, pop those little screws right there and flip it over to the other side, and you have an ambidextrous pocket clip. Very, very cool. Ambidextrous. Let me tell you something. I was not able to say injection molded yesterday to save my No, eyes. she wasn't. Injection molded was hard. Inject. We just went Inject back to GFN handle. Yeah. That's right. <laughs> Glass-filled <laughs> nylon. It's. This knife is so easy to open. It is. Yes. It just really is. I wonder if we do the Bryce flick. Nope, cannot. Can't get my fingernail in there. He was fun. He was fun. He was a good dude. Good dude from CRKT. He was Gertis. Gertis. <laughs> oh, you almost had it. Almost wags. Do a wrist flick at the end. There you go. And what do we call that if it's not involving a spider co? This one's a buck flick. <laughs> Which do not say that too many times in a row, or you're gonna be in trouble. I got arrested for that one time. <laughs> <laughs> I was in New Orleans. Oh, I performed a bug flick. Yeah. <laughs> they put me in jail. <laughs> <laughs> it was Mardi Gras. I thought I was safe. Buck flick. I work with someone who he's from New Orleans. That's Every a buckle. <laughs> Get it together. Uh, you can't even do the buckle flick again. Way to flick that buckle. <laughs> How much is this thing, Jason? None your business. What it is? Twenty five bucks. Twenty five <laughs> bucks for an American made buck. Twenty five. Twenty eight. You can buck flick. Bucks. With the buck hole. <laughs> buck, yeah. I love it. Oh, that's fucking great. I love it. <laughs> uh, the buck out of here. Yeah. Be careful. You're doing good. Yeah. I'm so proud of that. I'm like that. I like it. Your turn. Do it. No. <laughs> Your turn. Do it. <laughs> I'd be great if you just went full thumb hole. Mm. Well, I thought about it. That's what I actually did with this one down here that we'll talk about in a few minutes. Yep. Yes. I, I do really like that, and for 25 it's bucks. a nice little EDC. USA EDC. made buck. That is terrific. <laughs> I'm a buckle, all, aren't I? <laughs> we are all saucy this show. Buck in the USA. <laughs> Come on, you can do it. I love it. And that again, one, it loves 25 you. bucks. Yeah. You got a buck fan in your life? Buck them right up with this. <laughs> Christmas. <laughs> Christmas. Yep. Stockings. Bucky. 25 Christmas. Christmas. bucks. 25 bucks. We're becoming monosyllabic <laughs> at the end of the year. Christmas. Buck, buck. Stockings. <laughs> buck. Buck. <laughs> buck. <laughs> buck hole. Here we go. Moving on. John's going to put in subtitles that are full senses. That's right. What Andy's trying to say is, is that you could buy this for Christmas for a friend. <laughs> a dear buck hole friend. <laughs> and now we move to the EDC, EDC of, the week. of the week, which oh, is... Oh, I love this one. The Comoran. Which could also be the bargain of the week. It really could. 
I think all of them could. They could, yes. Those Two first, though, buying one of each of the first three doesn't get you free shipping. No. I'm just saying. <laughs> oh, this thing. So this is the Comoran Frame Lock. Yes. Uh, to gonna put it out there. It's fifteen dollars. Yes. It has terrific action. It has, has that a, amazing upswept blade. Hit it has wax. an eight inch. 450A. 450? It's not 8 inches inches either. What are you? It's a 3.5 inch. It has a a 3.5 inch. (laughs) You had your chance. 3.5 inch, 440A upswept blade (laughs) with a satin finish. 0.11 inches thick, manual flipper, frame lock, steel back scale. And a black and blue G10 carbon fiber front scale with a blue anodized hardware, including a tip up pocket clip, a lanyard hole. It's 4.5 inches closed, 8 inches overall, and it weighs 4.2. Ounces. Bam! <laughs> Bam! I mean, come on. I, For a good, inexpensive EDC, yes. this is the perfect it's EDC really of the week. It's really pretty, and it has and a it is, really good action on it. It has great action, and it's so cool looking. And really thin, too. We yeah. keep hearing from people on the That's SMKW. That's what John said. John picked up, and he was like, That's super thin. People on the SMKW Army are constantly putting up pictures, excuse me, of their Comoran <laughs> and. Comoran and Rough Rider. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Killing it. It's pretty. Yeah. It is really, pretty. really nice. I love an upslip blade. I know. And that one is like it's extreme. More dangerous. Slicey, slicey. Give me some slash. Give, give me some slash. You want some slash? Give me, give me some paper over there. <laughs> give me some slash. Pappy, give, give me some paper. <laughs> Hold on, let me find you an old piece of paper. Uncle Baby Billy. Baby Billy. Baby Billy says, uh, cut this paper right here. Now look here, dear girl. You got to be careful I, not to I, cut the hands I got off. my clogging shoes on. That's right. That's nice. Look at that! Look at you go! Oh lord. It's making it rain. <laughs> no, I'm just making a mess. I'm about to say, now you're just cutting off a little Now plexus. gather up all your little <laughs> shards and hand him that knife. There you go, little I girl. really dig that. That's a fun knife. Uh, you're is. talking about somebody who's wanting to get... Don't do it. Don't do it. just got the dad it. voice. I did. <laughs> don't do that. Do not do that in the middle of my show. Nope. I will murder you with one of these select there we tools go. here. You would put your I hand under I will stab under you all the way to the I'm I know. You put your hand right under the knife as he flicked it Right open. into his hand. Yeah, whatever. Yeah, whatever. Wouldn't I, be the first time I, I remember flicked it like that. Uh, stocking stuffer and a half right there. Oh, for no thing. Yeah. You know what I had never noticed? So that we've got come the ring on the pocket clip. Yeah. That's really cool. And yes. one of them good pocket clips, too. Yeah. Yes. It's a little ski jump. A little spatula there at the end. Who slides knows? right in your pocket. There you go. You bounced oh, it back. you did. Yep. That's why we don't do that. As he's and done he it for like it all the time. <laughs> Sassy pants. Here. Comrade. I love it. Ding. That's 15 bucks. You are a dad. Yes, I am. Clearly. Don't do that. A dad That's of a child who is your age. So, 15, 25, 15. So what? Blue, 32, 32. Omaha. Omaha, 50, 55 bucks gets you all three of those. Yes. Yes. And you got three great knives. Do it twice. Six knives, six presents, free shipping. Or yes. maybe you can just add this to it, and that's a present for yourself. That's for sure. You are not wrong. Pull it in. This. <laughs> not so much a neck knife for Andy. Is Apparently it? it's a pull toy. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I kind of laughed Do at it. that. It's the White River Knives M1 Backpacker. Very good. It is. And S35 VN steel. Don't Three inch it. blade. Three inch blade. I'm going to find the focus here. Oh, wait. What I'm going to close, finish? John. Oh, oh, there we go. What kind of finish? What kind of finish? Stone wash. How thick is it? It is one eighth of an inch thick. Man. What kind of construction? Full tang. One, one piece, piece, but we'll give you that. Whatever. Same difference. What, what kind of handle? Uh, the handle is uh, reflective green paracord wrapped handle. It's impressive. What kind of sheath? Uh, it has a Kydex sheath. It is a neck knife sheath. However, in the box, it has a clip that you put on this thing and put it on your belt. It also has a matching lanyard cord. How big is it overall? How big is it overall? It is 6.5 inches? Six so inches? So close. Seven inches. I was really close. How much does it weigh? Um, three point five ounces. 
2.4, 2.4 ounces. Where was it made? It was made right here in the good old USA by White River Knives. Good stuff. Six different wraps and configurations available. Very good, sir. That was impressive. It was impressive. Mm -hmm. I love that knife. They're nice. And those itches. Yeah, 96 bucks on this thing, though. It's a made in the USA. Sure. It is S35VN. See, but it's S30VN. S35VN for. The entire knife is that. Yes. Really? For do that. 96 bucks. How they do what? Wrap the cord? They do it fancy like. I can see that. They got a Jared. professional cord wrapper. Jared wraps pinky. them all. They send them to him. <laughs> Give me a pinky. Give me a pinky. <laughs> I, I love it though. It I like the sheath. Good feel. It has a great feel. Especially where your finger is, it's like nice and rounded, mm -hmm. and like you say, no bite to it. Yeah. It Try it out in, in your little holster there, sir. In my little, your little knife holster. This is where you almost stabbed yourself yesterday, wasn't it? See the yeah. Ming. I, so, I, I dig mean, it. Yeah. Knife knife is convenient. It yes. really is. Hiking, camping, whatever. This one's great for just all the little work you need to do around camp. I like it. I like it a lot. Tell you what, after I bought my Minimalist from CRKT, I love that thing and I use it a lot for house. Feels that jumping. It, it it's really grabby. is extraordinary, it's yeah. Grabby. grabby without being uncomfortable. It's so, <laughs> it's nice and light, but it's a big enough knife to actually do stuff it's with. It's got girth. Yeah. Um, I, yes. I like it. Good stuff. I like it it's a got whole some bunch. to it. Not to be confused with girth. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, and you can feel that click home. You can uh -huh. see it actually in the Kydex, but you can feel it actually click home. Uh -huh. um, and then it doesn't go anywhere at all. <laughs> all of us do that in motion with, oh, please don't come out, oh, please don't come out. I, I love that knife, though. White River makes some really cool stuff, and that one's... Pocket candy traditional. You have to get a plow on the table? This is the Case 2019 Christmas Trapper. It's in focus. Is it? Yes. And this is the one with the engraved bolsters as well. Yes. God, look at that. That's so pretty. We have already sold a ton of these, folks. It is you want the yours. most collectible case yes. of the year. Every year it has been for 19 years running. If you want one, you need to buy one. You need to buy it quickly. So, True Sharp, Stainless Steel, Clip Point, and Spay Blades, Mirror Polish Finish, Color Christmas Embellishments on the Main Blade, Red Saw Cut Bone Handle, Case Santa Sleigh and Christmas Bell Shields, Engraved Nickel Silver Bolsters. We also have this one without the engraving on the bolsters. Uh, brass pins and liners, four and eight inches closed, four ounces, made in the USA. Um, and again, this is the most collectible one of the year, has been for 19 years. Um, if you want it, buy it, buy it quickly. They will not be around very long. Jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Oh, what fun it is oh my. I do not oh, sing Christmas songs like prior to Thanksgiving. It has not been Halloween yet. Um, we're showing a Christmas night. I don't care. I'm opposed to that too, but I have Rudolph to go along with it. No, reindeer. Okay. <laughs> after Thanksgiving swags, See, you I invited the singing, you. and this is what happens. After after Thanksgiving, I will sing Christmas songs with you every show. What's the but price tag on these, Jason? <laughs> <laughs> I think this one's sixty nine. Seventy bucks. Sixty nine ninety nine, yeah, and then the unengraved bolster one is fifty nine ninety nine. You're yes. fifty nine. Uh, no, forty seven. Uh, and the, he the, said, don't be going ad in years. So I don't know which one I like better. The plane looks really good and clean. It's but holly. The grave I don't know if you really noticed cool. that yesterday when we looked at it. That's yeah. a little holly and berries. Yeah. A little yeah. holly berry. It turned out so good. Yeah. Then you say I like They got holly berry on there. They That's did. Weird. See, I was setting you up for that right I there. Like it. It's nice. Yeah. It's a nice knife. Seriously, uh, grab these and the other case collectibles at Christmas. Keep them clean. Keep them nice. Keep them nice. I'm sorry, I'm just going to ignore her. Yes, you, you should. Keep them clean. Oh. Keep them nice for your collectible. Yeah. And this keep is running that collection. Cool. Fantastic. That is the Pocket Candy Traditional. Pocket Candy. What do you have on you? I don't know. It was under the table. Hmm. Now, Somebody now, bubble gum? Now he's going to have to find his mark again. Ha! <laughs> <laughs> Poker Gust. Pocket Gust. Candy Modern. The Gust. Yes. The gust. First things first, I love the finish on this knife. It's pretty. It looks like it's some kind of alien it, um, tank tread. It kind of does. Vintage. Did Burnley do this one too? Uh, I don't think so. <laughs> Just had to ask. Serge. So the Boker Plus Gust 
Gus. 2.9 inch D2 drop point blade with a stone wash finish, 0.1 inches thick, Thumb hole opener, frame lock, bronze colored stainless steel front handle, stone wash steel back handle, tip up pocket clip, lanyard hole, 3.7 inches closed, 6.6 .6 inches overall, and it weighs a little bit more than five ounces. What I like about this knife is that it's small, but it has like some big oomph on the blade. It really does. So like yeah. that blade is big and pretty. It's almost leafy. It's got some sureness to it. And it is just a simple one-hand opener that I have I have ripped my finger yesterday on the Sarah yeah. KT show. I ripped that nail right back. You do that a lot. I do. You do. And, I, I, and I can see it from over here when you do it, and, like, and it makes me cringe. Yeah, it doesn't feel good. So close. So close, but yet so far. You're almost there. That blade has some real... You just scare the hell out of me sometimes. Some real <laughs> thickness to it. <laughs> She is trying the. Uh, oh! <laughs> what was his total? What was his whole name yesterday? What? Bryce oh, hey. Gerard. From? Bryce Gohard Gerard. From, From Brevard. From Brevard. Backflip. Ah, right. done it. <laughs> his brother Beauregard. That's the gust. I like this knife. Yeah, I just. Mm. I'm really happy with we this. We all got really thing. quiet watching you open. Yes, because I'm afraid she's going to throw it and kill me. No, it has a tremendous it frame lock. That frame lock is, them, is big and beefy. Okay. The uh, oh. and again the finish on the knife continues down <laughs> that back scale. Uh huh. And even the front has that stone wash to it. Yes. Um, I I just really like it. It looks like it's been through the war. It looks like one of those sci-fi movies that. Uh, where they do the different washes. I, I'm thinking of the last yeah. Star Wars movie where they're uh, running through the portal train station thing. Do you know what I'm talking about? Yes. You know exactly what I'm talking about. Yeah, of it's course. Those, yeah. <laughs> to me, it looks like you pulled out of a Terminator skull. Yeah, could be. In T2. Yeah. It has that look of the, of the, the tr like you said, with the treads, yes. and it's just that stone wash finish all the way around. Yes. I like it. I like it a lot. Yeah. That's the Pocket Candy uh, Modern. Very, very nice. From Boker Plus right there. I'm not going to do that again because it hurts my finger. Let's see if it hurts it's sharp. my finger. Oh. Do you want Melina? This design has Sergei. I can't say his last name. Oh, spell okay. it. Okay. Spell the last You don't know it? it you didn't look it up. She can't just pronounce it. She can't say it because she doesn't know what it is. No, it's the same, You're it's so the same mean. one that did the um, coin claw. Oh. oh. It starts with P. Sergei. Pinchinko? Pinchinko. Yes. yes. Pinchinko. Thank you for looking that <laughs> up. No, I didn't look it up, but she did. Or she for knowing it. it. She. <laughs> Sergey Pinchinko. I like this design. That is a nicely a a sharpened knife. blade. Yeah. Do that one. It, it, has, it has such a good look and feel to it. It's 60 bucks. <laughs> that and one for, is a And for nice 60 bucks. Don't go, don't go big. <laughs> Calm yourself. Calm yourself. Calm yourself. For 60 bucks, you're getting a whole lot of, of finish and that look gem. and features, and it's yeah. a D2 blade. It's just it's very, very cool. I, I love it. I like it quite a bit. And last but not least is the premium pick of the week. She said yesterday, finally, we get to do, do number one. one. Yeah. It's the launch <laughs> one. I don't understand why we went through like wait, eight, six, three, two, number one. This is the one that started it all. It is. It's the, the original launch one. So, 3.4 inch CPM 154 clip point blade, stone wash finish, 0.12 inches thick, uh, push button out the side, automatic aluminum handle, ambidextrous tip up pocket clip, integrated back spacer and lanyard spacer. 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 Integrated back spacer and lanyard tie off. See, look at that thing. See, it's there's very, a very hole cool. that comes from right there and comes out this end. Bing. That's nice. Uh, 4.6 inches closed, 8 inches overall, 4 ounces, made in the USA by Kershaw. So I love Kershaw, but I'm willing to argue with them about two things. Okay. okay. This looks like a drop point, and it looks like it's black wash. We finish. agreed that it was black wash yesterday. I don't know if Kershaw says this one is a drop point or a clip point. They said clip. We're saying clip on it. I think it is a drop point as well. I think it could be, and I, it also has a little bit of that harpoon back to it. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. It's still a gorgeous knife. Oh yeah, but oh, yeah. I, I'm, I'm argumentative. No, but I, I and here comes the deb debate team beside me. No, I, I'm agreeing <laughs> with you though because I really like it. I dig it. That is super nice. It's a nice full size EDC automatic. 
nice snap on it, not too crazy popping out of your hand. You've got yeah, that nice got resist. got a big, nice blade on it, too. Automatic button so you don't have the fear of, oh, it needs a safety. I always like they put the American flag on, on the Always, USA. yeah. It's lasered right under your finger. <laughs> I know. Very, very cool. <laughs> Were you hiding it on purpose? No, I wasn't talking about that. I had someone argue with me that they weren't. Oh, they yeah, weren't I made in the that. US. Yeah. I was like, really? About 40% of their products are made in the US. Yeah, yeah honestly. It's a very, 45, very... 40, 45% of Kershaw's products are know. originate right here in the US. That is There's a even a well, American flag on it. Yeah, that is a well made, well thought out knife. All of the edges are rounded off the way. There is almost no difference mm -hmm. in where the back of that knife and the, the back of the handle are. Right. Mm -hmm. It's it's just, there's a lot of detail in that. Yeah. I like it a lot. That whole launch series, though. Oh, they're all nice. Have we ever had them all out at the same time? No. That'd be fun to do. I think one of those was the one I threw as well. I think it was. Yeah, probably. I believe it's the eight. Could be. Um, Sorry, guys. And there's so much difference in those from this to the 10. Yeah. They're all different. They're oh, fantastic. Yeah. We've got them in colors now, which yeah. is kind of cool. They're really, really great. They all originally were this black with this. Um, I like that a lot. It, no, it's really cool. Uh, 115 for that one, which that's why it's again, the premium pick of the week. Yeah, for the tech you're getting in that knife. But still, 115 is, is really yeah, not bad. Is yeah, is really good price. Do you know what I like about these? To, uh, other than you know what we've said so far, it's the fact that they make almost every single one of their autos as an ambidextrous carry. Mm -hmm. So well, they you've realize got the that tip up, reversal or ambidextrous pocket clip sure. on these, and removable if you just don't want it at all. Sure. sure. They, they realize that you know there are some some lefties out there. Yeah. That uh, might want an automatic knife or just a pocket knife in general. The cool thing about an out the side well. auto too is you can operate it left hand with no problem whatsoever. Yeah. You just <laughs> push the button with your index finger rather than your thumb. Yep. I have been called a thumb before. And so. while that feels very strange to my left hand, the opening action is not bad at all. Mm -hmm. Any questions, comments, thoughts? They want to know about the November box. They want to know about the November box. It's, it's coming, coming out. in November. <laughs> November 6th, it'll ship? Yes, it will ship at the beginning of November. <laughs> it will have things in it. It will. Some of those things will be sharp and pointy. Yes. If you get the low box, it will have a certain amount of things. If you get the next <laughs> box, it will have all those things plus some more things. And if you get the top end box, it will have all the things plus another thing. Yes. It'll have stickers. Yes. <laughs> it'll it will have, have candy. It'll be in yeah. a box. It'll be in a box. There and the be, box will uh, have stamps. There will be camo paper wrapped around it. There will be. There will be a piece of paper on the inside that tells you what's inside that box. Oh. And if you happen to be a box subscriber, mm -hmm. you have gotten an email crafted by one Sean mm -hmm. exactly. asking you to log into your account and put in a shirt size. We're not saying why. Just go fill in your shirt size because next There's Thursday. There's not a shirt coming in it. There's not. No. Nope. In this box? No, nope. there would never be a shirt. No, nope. we just want no, to know no, what size want, you yeah, are. Yeah, just in general. She's just not we're teasing kinda, you. We're kind of nosy. Yeah. At yeah. some point, we may decide to put shirts in boxes. And if you have not gone and filled in your shirt size, you're getting a large. You're getting a large. <laughs> it's happening. Yep. Just so saying. go do the thing. But that would be thing. if we were going to be, you know, give a shirt. Read the email. Do the words. Yes. Do the, the words. Yes. Words. There's a link. <laughs> words. Go do the link and the words. Well, don't do the link, but do the you words. Can do the link. <laughs> Click the link. Click the, the words. Link. <laughs> you know, I really kind of like that as a left hand knife. Yeah. Nice. I'm gonna convert. I'm gonna like, start with my left hand all the time. You should. You can't read my hand right now. I know. It wouldn't matter. <laughs> when I broke my thumb, I had to write with my four fingers. My left hand is so useless. I would rather just write with my four fingers than use my left hand. I typed. It was so bad. With these five really? fingers. Really? <laughs> yes. I took keyboarding, not typing. Yeah. I took keyboarding in high school. I do the same thing. And I was. I, I just hunt and pick. I use all my fingers. I don't. I use I've all never my learned fingers. how to type, but I just got used to using my fingers, so nope. Just made them all happen. Other questions, comments, thoughts? Pocket dump. Pocket oh. dump. <laughs> I'm going last today. Okay. Are you? Yep. I'll go first. I, I got a present. I'm just traditional today. Are you really? Yeah. I did not put a um, What are you thinking? I'm thinking I oh, love this. Oh, dude. Ooh. This is my uh, American Ace design I for love Rough that Rider. One. Um, this little guy 
right that here. That is such a cool one. We did one. two of these. We did an American yeah. Hero and American Ace. These are inlays, and I can turn it like that so you can see. But I want to do this one to look like a World War II fighting plane, an yeah. Ace. And it has the markings like you would have found on the um, Allies planes. Yeah. So these would have been the wing markings, and then you have the drab gray in the center, and then the U.S. marking That's in so the cool. center. I and then of course that. it has American A's, I think. But uh, this is part of my collection. We're out of these. We're not probably getting them back every I would, day. Yeah, I wouldn't say So that. if you run across one of these, get it. It's yep, a collectible. It's collectible. This is my American Ace Trapper. That's so cool. <laughs> Very I good. I have my Timberlands Simba. Rock on. Nice. You even got a little seatbelt cutter with it. Oh, that rocks. Nice. And then the Rough Rider Fixed Blades. <laughs> She's got the combo yeah. set. Heck yeah. And two. Hold them up so they can see them. Yeah. What have you been cutting with that? Why is it gnarly nasty on a eating Um, I was carving a couple of different things. Ew. A pumpkin. A pumpkin. And a watermelon. And a watermelon. Someone and some poor My brother little threw fella. it up just a little. He got in the car when he was hitchhiking. <laughs> this is a little watermelon. My brother threw it up and I went. <laughs> I was really proud that I stabbed it. <laughs> just hold that down there so they can see the handles. So they are person. very pretty. This is the RR. Do you know what one this was? Uh, I don't remember. I don't either. Look at look at those handles, man. You got the the so bone pretty. in the middle. Then you've got some stacked stuff here that is fantastic. Yeah. And they both match. Lovely, I lovely did. knives. You even got a sheath that holds both of them. Yeah. It's a pretty stand up. Yeah. What's we'll that? Show them your sheath. See. Yep. See that? Here. You put this in there here. You become the fixed blade queen. I love fixed blades. It makes me feel dangerous. <laughs> it's definitely taken down the are. amount of people. I was people. just going to say, she yes. doesn't have to really feel it. She isn't. Well, it's definitely taken down the amount of people who like stop and be like, hey, can I talk to you for a second? I'm like, <clears throat> no. <laughs> Pulls out the knife, sticks it in the ground. That's right. People, Starts making people, grunt noises. Like, I don't know, gas station. Gas station people uh -huh. want to talk to me so bad. And I'm like... At what point did my face look like, hey, let's have a 30 minute conversation <laughs> about the cigarettes that you just found on the ground? That's exciting. Oh. So. Oh. Jimmy slashes. He gets me. He's the he bomb. gets you. He, he feels you. This is a cold steel Spartan. And it even has a little Spartan. That's awesome. Here, here, here we'll, oh, we'll hold it so you can awesome. see that Spartan oh. skull on the lander. Jimmy Slash is awesome. It is. Look at that thing. Jimmy Slash is the best, and that so knife awesome. is amazing. Look at the side. It's just, it has little spikes on the helmet. I'm telling you. Look at the size of this thing. This is a, isn't there a Colossus that's like this too? I but this is, is the smaller version yeah. of the, yeah. Yeah, I, I, I completely dig that. That is so gnarly. Yeah. Oh. It is nice and big and beefy, and it's a cold still. And I bet you could just slice I'm, one of these like things in half. I'm gonna, like his drink. I'm yeah. going to find a shoe and <laughs> stab it through a meat shoe. It's a, Look it's at all the fuzz big. on that thing. Yeah, all right. Probably Clean too. off his fuzz. <laughs> you got pocket fuzz up in there? Okay, so I was gross, but you were just like, oh, just clean up his fuzz. Just <laughs> clean up. Yours was like gooey. I haven't used what? that to take apart any hand fruit yet, but uh, it shall be done. This is this what is they always want to see. It's got, a, it's got a heck of a lock back on it. See? Can we do it for you, Jason? You may have to. <laughs> I think what I like best about this, though... Yeah, how easy it is to open? Oh, no, I thought I was thinking that. It's just... Uh oh. It's ridiculous. all cool. It looks like a gladius handle. Yes. A what? A gladius, a Roman short short. Could be gladius. Gladius. Could be gladius. 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 <laughs> You're not glad to see a gladius. You are glad to see a gladiator. Like not a gladiator. Unless gladiator. you're in the Florida ever gladiators. If they're in the glades. In the glades. <laughs> Could you find my glades? I know that well, has been my pocket dump for several days now and that. My wife looks at me and goes, are you carrying the huge knife again? Yes, yes I, I am. am. <laughs> yes, I am. I bet your wife gets a kick out of all the things that you do. Awesome. Nice. I kind of like it as a patch. I know, Dude, right? right? Put it right here. Just do it as like an elastic armband. We can just pass them out. We like have the whole brigade. <laughs> That's the way to be an army. And easy too. Yes. We got an idea. Telling you. Yeah. Write it down. Write it down. We'll need your welcome. arm. Questions. And sizes. Comments. No questions. Included in us off. We did two lives this week. And we question them out. We have. Actually, there is one. Yes. Uh, that bug vantage. It comes in other colors, doesn't it? Like black. It does come in black. I yes. don't think it's at that price point in black. I think it's $10 difference. Yes, $10 difference. Yeah. This is the one that is 
priced right at twenty four ninety nine. Any what question, other are questions? You playing? My emoji game, you <laughs> Jeez Louise. <Shut> up. <laughs> I'm going to look up the Buck Vantage. It's okay, book watch comics. Vantage. This is, I mean, like riveting television. Look. Well, y'all can keep talking. <laughs> no, we're going to watch you. <laughs> Apparently. Yes. Uh, there's actually a Buck Vantage, like large and small. Yes. In black. Question. Can you show the slip joint again, please? I will show all of the things again as we do the rundown. Yes, indeed. And we are ready for the rundown, yes? Yeah. Okay, something new this week is the Marbles. Fantastic cleaver. This thing has a 440A stainless steel blade. It is, what, 3 sixteenths of an inch thick? Yes. Boom! Stonewash finish in the grind, brushed finish in the flats, Raindrop G10 with the red liners, full tank construction. Can chop off a thumb like that. Got a no. lanyard hole and rivets here. Fantastic on this thing. Comes with this doohickey of a sheath. Real nice with an easy snap. You it is a great little knife for $14.99. May or may not know. Are they going to do any more with that type of handle? I do not know. I do God, not know. I, I just love that. I think I, you I know, love some, to see. Sometimes we produce uh, samples and sometimes the samples come to us and we go, yes, please. Yeah. And that well, was one of these. I, I would love to see. We'll have to talk to Tyler and Kevin. I'd love to see more in that series with that handle. Yeah, no, they're pretty. Yeah. They're really pretty. $14.99. Really that is the something new from uh, Marbles. Go Marbles. Bargain of the week is the Buck Vantage Select Liner Lock. Yeah. Ooh, almost dropped it. Don't do that. 420HC Blade. It has that wonderful buck um, hole right in it that mm -hmm. you can use to open this knife. You have a flipper as well. <laughs> Stonewash finished. Injection molded. GFN. Olive OD Green handle. It is a liner lock. That is what's different about these. Most of the time, the bucks are a lock back. Yeah. This is an actual liner lock. That is an ambidextrous tip-up pocket clip, and I like this thing a lot. It is also twenty-four ninety-nine mm -hmm. mm. from Book. Right there. Great knife. That is the bargain of the week. EDC of the week is the Comeron Flame. Flame lock. I do that <laughs> flame every lock. time. Comeron frame lock. This has a 440A stainless steel upswept blade. I like this thing, guys. It is just really, really pretty. It's got a steel back frame. It is a frame lock. It has a G10 and carbon, fi carbon, carbon fiber <laughs> overlay. It has some anodized blue hardware on it, including these little screws, the pivot, and that lovely Comeron pocket clip that is tip up on the back. Look at that. You got your landing hole right there. $14.99 from Comeron. Can't beat that. First three knives, 55 bucks. Yeah, that's really, really nice on the EDC of the week. Fixed blade of the week is the White River Knives M1 backpacker knife. It comes, it can be a neck knife. It comes with a little clip that goes on this Kydex sheath that makes it a belt knife. Um, this thing is gorgeous. It's S35 VN steel made right here in the USA. Full tank construction, stone wash finish, reflective green paracord wrap on this thing. Check out the lanyard hole. The Kydex sheath comes with a matching one. There are six different configurations and steels available in this little bad boy. This is from White River Knives made right here in the USA. The price point on it, Jason, was 90 something? 96, 95. 95 dollars from 95. White River Knives right there, the fixed that's, blade that's of the so week. That's so cool. Yes. And we have six different versions of this available as well. This is the most collected knife from Case in our building every single year for 19 years running. Yep. This is the Case Christmas Trapper right here. True Shop Sugar. Let's start again. True Sharp Surgical Steel Blades with the color Christmas embellishment on that clip point blade. You've got red saw cut uh, bone handles that are just gorgeous. You can see that saw cut when I do that. Look at that. You got two shields, not one, two for the price of one right here. Santa Slay shield and a Christmas bell shield. This is the engraved bolster version. So this little bad boy actually has holly. Uh, leaves and berries on its bolsters. We do have a plain version as well on this thing. It is This one is $69.99 and the unengraved bolster version is $59.99. Again, when these are gone, they're gone. Yes. And I promise you, they will be gone. We Soon. order a lot of them, yeah. but they will go. So if you want one, get one. Yeah, or if you've got the catalog that dropped this past week, this was the front cover item. It's there for a reason, folks. Right. <laughs> um, Pocket Candy Modern is oh. the Boker Gust. Yeah. Um, Spotty Flicky. 
I ain't gonna spider flick it because I can't do it. This thing has, um, Jason, what was this steel? D2? Uh, D2, yeah. Yeah, D2 with a really unique stone wash. It almost has a bronze feel to that stone really wash nice. on it. Oh, uh, yeah. You have steel. Both sides are steel. This is a frame lock side. This one is a bronze color steel on that front side with a nice design. Um, great knife, lanyard hole, uh, tip up pocket clip that is removable if you want, thumb hole opener, or we can thumb hole flick it open as Swags has proven. And this bad boy is 60 bucks. Yeah. 60 bucks from Boca Plus. Ooh, I spit everywhere. You do what you got to do, man. I'll let it, li let it fly right there. And last but not least, the premium pick of the week is the Kershaw Launch 1. Uh, was was it Boy. CPM 154? Yes, indeed. CPM 154 on the blade. It is a black wash finish. Uh, Swags and I are going with a drop point on this one. Uh, yeah, yeah. A little bit of right. har harpoon style. Ding! <laughs> we just bumped out of camera just then. It is an aluminum handle. It has that integrated lanyard hole that kind of goes like right through there. I it's really like fantastic. that. Fantastic. It's got a great uh, spot yeah, for, for it. Sure. Yeah, it's an out the side auto with a recessed push button right here. It is an ambidextrous tip up pocket clip good for righties and lefties look at that usa flag right there that means it's made so nice. in the usa Amazing. and this thing is 116 dollars yes 115 115 dollars oh. yeah. great and that is our lineup for this week any yes. other questions comments thoughts conundrums <laughs> concerns Melinda's like man we did a live yesterday and they are raw today <laughs> Wow. <laughs> 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 you know, I'm kind of torn. I like everything on the table. Yeah. I really kind of digging that white river, though. I like that a lot. What do you like on the table? Oh, my God. It's so hard between those three. Oh, yeah? Yeah. What are you picking? What am I picking? I'm just kind of digging the Boker Gust. Really? Uh, yes. Yeah, I really I thought right. you'd be going for this. It's pretty. I think I like this is like a spear. I think I just like the fact that I know how to backflick now. Yes. I think back, that's all back that is. Backflick your buckhole. That's an amazing knife. It is, but it has you such know a what? Good feel. I, go uh, with I know. I knew right? you were gonna go with the fixed blade. I'm sorry. I really like fixed blades. I do too. I really like flippers too, but fixed blades are just gnarly. <laughs> gnarly. <laughs> I like this <laughs> They're all nice. And it's 115 bucks. <laughs> yeah. And for a USA Mine's Microsoft. only 15. Yeah. I know, right? Ha ha. So we're gonna have to pick a giveaway. Oh, we do two. What? Yeah, that's what I was saying. Can we do two? Um, we've done two the last two times. And so I'm let's not do gonna, three. Well, we're not gonna do three. <laughs> we're gonna pick one. I think we should. And do. I can tell you what they can't be. They right. cannot be that Kershaw, and they cannot be that White River. And they cannot be that. And so. they cannot be that. I was thinking. I was thinking this. I was thinking. That I was thinking well. that as well. Yeah. Oh, cool. Guys. I was thinking all three because I'm nicer than he is, but. Just, just, just what it is. Just saying. We're going to give away the Marbles Cleaver. It is a fantastic knife. It is a fun is. knife. I love it. Uh, we need a hashtag. Wait a minute. We have a question, Moyne? Yes, I'm sorry. Uh, when are Black Friday sales going to be announced? Um, they will be announced. Soon. Soon. I'm naming this Thunder. If, if you have been a fan for over a year, you might have an idea. Of when they happen. <laughs> yes. Yes. We're not going to tip that information. No, we never yet. do. Um, we are going to tell you ahead of time. Know that they are coming, and they are tremendous and a heck of a lot of fun. Yeah. Hashtag thunder. Thunder? I like it. I'll yes. take it. Hashtag thunder. Hashtag thunder is what you're going to put as a reply to this uh, video if you want to do it. Guys, remember to like, share, and subscribe to these videos. She went with that. I went to ACDC. Yeah. You went Come to that on. thunder song that's so annoying, isn't it? That is yeah. not annoying. Thunder. 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 I like it. Thunder. Instead of, you know, just English my... people and Australian people screaming, Thunder! <laughs> it's right. <laughs> <laughs> okay. You guys. Like, share, and subscribe to these videos. Mm -hmm. Do it on YouTube. Do it on Facebook. If you have not already joined the SMKW Army on Facebook, please go get in the private group. Over yeah. 3,000 now there. Over 108,800 of you are following us on Facebook right now. It practice is, your back flicks. Yes, practice your black back flicks. <laughs> I'm glad I didn't say that with the buckhole. I know. It would have been bad. Make sure you're uh, getting into the contest that we do each week. One on Instagram, one on Facebook each week. Do that. Uh, 
you're going to have to pay attention to the schedule because as we head towards the holidays, some of yeah. these things are going to get switched up and we'll let you know when that happens. Sometimes it's going to be a live on Tuesday. Sometimes it's going to be uh, a For live sure. on Thursday. But we will let you know every time ahead of time when those things are going to happen. But trust uh, us, there will be one. Come join us next week for Halloween. Oh, please come Halloween is going week. to be a blast. It is going to be fun. It is going to be a lot of fun. Yes. John's back in the studio back there. Jared is right there in the floor laying on his back. I'm not sure what he's doing. <laughs> He just doesn't He's want practicing to. He's his yoga. Oh, okay. Got it. Melina has it been answering all of your questions. Dog right. That's what I was going to Yeah, down and dog. And upward dragon, which is a new pose he's inventing. Okay. <laughs> Leave him alone. That happens. Melina's been answering your question. That's Jason. That's Swags. I'm Andy. And this has been another episode of Guys Talk Knives. Live, we will catch you <laughs> almost, almost next time. Bye. You are getting good at that. No. It's so really good at this. Is the Medford of fixed blade marbles? Uh, Medford marbles.